drowning, I'm drowning, I'm drowning, I'm drowning. I'm drowning, I'm drowning, I'm drowning. So everybody has a story about how they learn to swim. Typically, for some people, they actually take lessons and they go to classes, they learn how to swim. Now, sadly, I was not one of those children. So we're at my cousin's apartment pool and my dad shows up. I'm standing at the edge of the pool watching everybody else have fun, splash their feet, spray each other with water guns, laugh, play, have fun. My dad comes behind me, asks, how can you get in the pool? I can't swim. Shut up, boy. Yes, you do. No, I don't. So, about three or four seconds later, I feel a big pair of hands on my waist, and I'm lifted into the air. Daddy, no! No, 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 no. Is, it, is this it? Is this the end? What awards will be left here? Who am I really as a person? I think I'm about to high five God. Now, I couldn't tell you what age I was, but I can definitely tell you it was under the age of seven or eight. When he threw me in the air, I was staring down at this blue liquid called death, what everybody else calls a pool. And I look up to the sky, pray for God's blessing. As I'm coming down from touching heaven and high-fiving God, I'm looking at my dad. I want him to know that I know that he knows I just told him I can't swim. I can't swim. So we're making eye contact the whole way. I hit the water. I'm struggling, not knowing what to do. You know how when you're you know how when you're underwater you can still look and see above the water it just looks kind of fuzzy so I see him at the edge of the pool I know he knows that I know I just saw him walk away I am still struggling at the same time I know this is a wrap this is done the devil is a lie go swimming they said it'd be fun they said suddenly I see the shadow hover above me and I hear Kadoosh. dad picks me up out of the water and puts me on the edge of the pool. <gasps> oh. Now I climb back on to the pool deck. I'm alive and well. I'm looking at him. Look at me. Look back at him. Do y'all know what he had the nerve to ask me? He asked me, why don't you start swimming? I can't swim. I can't swim. I can't swim. It wasn't until after that event that my parents then took us to go swimming almost every day. I became a well-equipped swimmer, became a lifeguard. I did diving in high school. Swimming now is no problem to me I just I didn't think I'd be taking that path down the road to learn how to swim I thought it was baby steps not high-fiving God first taking blessings and prayers and then coming to the conclusion that I can take some lessons 
hopefully, if y'all want to learn how to do something, y'all take these baby steps. I mean, if you want to jump into something, literally, then by all means, you know, you can do it. I'm not against it. Just make sure you have a backup plan if things do go south, like touching the bottom of the pool and not knowing how to swim. Other than that, man, I think that was a pretty splendiferous experience, if I may say so myself. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, oh uh, yeah, yeah. So just remember, make memories to live and live to make memories. They will definitely get you going. You may look back at a memory and use it for your next child. And to be quite honest, that is probably the approach that I'm going to be taking. I'm drowning. I'm drowning. I'm drowning. I'm drowning.